Well, the thing that I'm looking forward to the most is seeing the people in the field that I know are LGBTQ people uh, out having a good time and being themselves. You know, I, I know how they all feel where they've always wanted to, or felt like they had to hide on a golf course. And so that day, nobody's gonna be hiding. When we first started talking about the San Francisco Pride Golf Tournament, the synergy between the fact that the 2020 PGA Championship is going to be here and that we're doing this Pride Tournament in partnership with the PGA of America and specifically our section, Northern California section, the PGA here, just seemed to be the perfect fit. It's amazing that we first planned this in February. We thought if we got 50 people, it would be a success. And now we're over 100, almost capacity. It just shows what uh, the community is uh, excited about once they hear the message about this golf tournament, spreading awareness. It's fantastic. It actually makes me kind of uh, emotional because, you know, it's a group that I'm a part of, the LGBTQ community, and now that I can actually talk about it with people that are running the game, and so that I'm really, you know, seen, uh, makes me excited to know that other people like me will be seen in the game going, going forward. What if we just work on a uh, little pitching and chipping today? I love it. The tournament is a pro-am to create uh, awareness and equality and equity in a, in a fun way. So, I mean, I guarantee you with some practice, you could do that, you know, nine out of 10 times. Actually, the, the golf that day, like first, second, third place, completely irrelevant. I mean, we might give out prizes, we might not, it doesn't matter. It's just about making sure everybody knows they can be there and go and play with a golf pro. And to have our event at TPC Hunting Park is gonna be uh, amazing. We're in San Francisco. This is a course for everybody. And that's the message that uh, we're trying to get out there with this tournament. Specifically, this is for LGBTQ community, but golf in general, we want to make a game for everybody, which traditionally it, 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 it hasn't been, and we're trending towards that, but a place like Harding Park lent itself to just being the, the perfect location for our tournament. So we'll put a uh, thank you letter for this year's tournament, along with a save the date for 2020, which will be Wednesday, June 24th, 2020. Excellent. Next year, I'm at the point in my life where I want to do something to help just kind of change the game for the better. I just want it to be where it doesn't become an issue for anybody, no matter what they are, age, color, gender, sexual orientation, whatever in golf. You know, and I think we're ready for that. I finally feel like out on the golf course, uh, I can be myself now, now that I'm a part of this tournament. And uh, at a golf course that legitimately is a major golf venue, um, it makes me want to go grab my club and go hit it.